I'm Lisa Egan, the director of the Reading North Reading Chamber of Commerce, and I'm joined here today with Jerry Farrelly of Farrelly Real Estate. Jerry is our committee chair for our upcoming North Reading Town Day, which we're very excited about. We're going to have the event right here at Ipswich River Park on Sunday, June 11th from 12 to 5. We wanted to get together to talk about the event and let people know about what to expect and also um, invite any local clubs, organizations, nonprofits, vendors, businesses to please get involved in our event. We're really looking forward to hosting the community and getting everyone together right before summer kicks off on Sunday, June 11th. We already have registration open and we're about a third full already, two full months out. So I encourage everyone to look at their chamber website, which is www.reading and reading for reading north reading chamber.com. We're really excited about this event because we have the perfect venue right here at Ipswich River Park and we're, we're hoping for a great warm day to bring people out to connect before summer starts and highlight local community groups, businesses, organizations. We're going to have a lot of great food and entertainment. We're actually going to be set up right here in our gazebo oh, yeah. uh, and we'll have different performers, local dance schools and um, karate groups performing and we're really getting everything together now. So if you're listening and you're interested, I encourage you to reach out via our website or even give me a call at 978-664-5060. One reason we wanted to get together and talk about this on NORCAM was because we won't, don't want any local organizations to miss out because we do expect to sell out again on Sunday, June 11th. We're really excited. We're going to have kids crafts, um, lots of low cost and free entertainment for the family. We specifically picked a Sunday afternoon because we knew that would be a good time for people before they um, finish up their school year and give some time to stop by, have lunch or grab a snack, refreshments with the family. We're planning on having a climbing structure as well as pony rides. Again, live entertainment, food, wow. and a barbecue. And Peter Acola is going to be our DJ for the day. Um, and the dance schools are going to be here from all across town with the karate school. They're going to be putting on different performances here in the gazebo area. And then we're going to utilize all the space here at Ipswich River Park. We're also going to have a dog show. Um, Bark and Roll is going to sponsor the dog show. So if you have a dog and you want to bring them down and have them participate in the dog show, that would be great and fun. And we're also going to have a bike parade for the kids. Andy Schultz um, is going to sponsor the bike parade and we're going to have it right out here in the parking lot. So have your kids decorate their bikes just like in the good old days of North Reading. Decorate your bikes and bring them down and we're going to have a bike parade and there will be prizes and um, a lot of fun centered around that. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. Um, in case people have questions, we will be shutting down part of Central Street, and we've arranged for transportation from the high school and batch school parking lot, so there'll be plenty of opportunity to shuttle back and forth. Um, we will have a bike drop-off here for the yes. kids' bikes. Um, we're going to have a specific spot um, on the entrance here, so if you want to drop your child's bike off before you park, feel free to do that. Both ends of um, Central Street right here will be... Um, cut off, but you can walk down as well and bring the bikes. Excellent. And I know the um, event will be a rain or shine day, but I'm sure it will be awesome. Yep. We're really hoping this becomes an annual tradition, and we encourage everyone to get involved and come, even if you just have a local group that you want to see um, or spread the word about, or we've invited the library to come and talk about their summer reading program yep. so kids can sign up. So we really want it to showcase North Reading businesses, North Reading vendors, and really the best of the community. So bring the nonprofits, clubs, and businesses together. Yep. And especially if you are a service business, um, it would be great for you to come down, set up a booth for yourself, and maybe have an activity um, for the kids. I know one company in town does a cornhole toss. So any type of activity that you can think of that maybe you want to um, be part of or 
have for part of that day, let either myself or Lisa know and we'll get you set up and you can have it right there in your booth. Everyone that registers will get a nice, is it 10 and a half by 10 and a half or 11 by 11? You'll get an 11 by an 11 space. Okay. Thank you for bringing that up. Yep. People will need to provide their own tables, chairs and pop-ups. This is being our first event. We're not prepared to rent them. However, there's lots of places we can suggest if someone needs to borrow or, or buy one for the event. And you don't have to sell something at that space, but you're more than welcome to sell your your goods but if you're a service and you want to do an activity in your particular space um, please feel free to do that and we're actually encouraging people to do that yeah that gives up gives people um, a nice reason to stop by and it's always a nice idea to stay top of mind if you have something with your logo on it even if it's you know a magnet or a chip clip people love that kind of stuff and again it helps keep you top of mind and helps bring visibility to your group or or business so and we're trying to we're really trying to bring the communities together the um, business community here in town um, as we depend on the community as a whole to keep our businesses going so we want the communities to learn about us so it's a real collaborative effort to make North Reading even better than it is now and it should be a great day for everybody yeah we're looking forward to it I don't think there's ever been anything on this scale no um, here in the park and you know we've got a milestone anniversary coming up as well so we're excited to showcase um, the park and we primarily will be set up here in this front section yes. for that day um, but of course we'll have great food and restaurants and food trucks and samples yep. and all sorts of good things happening so keep us posted or a good way to keep you posted I should say is um, by going to our Facebook page, Facebook page yep. and Jerry will also put it on her business Facebook page yep. just as people get um, signed up we do expect a sell out so if you're interested you do have to register in advance um, but again we'd love to set you up and um, showcase what you have going on and there's no admission fee to come to the event um, for people that are for the community that are coming in there's no admission fee just come on down have a good time support the local businesses, find out more about your town, and just have fun with your, your neighbors. Exactly. Sponsorships are available. As I said, we're going to yep. be um, hoping to make this an annual event, and we're going to do things like have a, a, an expense or free kids' craft area. Yep. So, for example, that's the kind of thing we'd be looking for sponsors for so we can put this on year after year. And all the funds raised would stay with the North Reading Town Committee. Right. So if... Um, so we can go forward and expand on it in expand, future years. Uh, expand on this event and also on the tree lighting on the common, which was great this past year. If money's raised at this event, we'll go towards making that even better, um, and we'll do better and better events for the town. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's always nice to have um, the ability to do new things at these kind of community events, and yeah. that's um, why the sponsors help, absolutely. Yeah. Good. So again, it's on Sunday. June 11th from 12 to 5. Registration is open now for vendors and groups. You need to pre-register and we do ex expect it to sell out. Feel free to go to our website which is www.reddingnreddingchamber.com or call me Lisa Egan at 978-664-5060. We'd love to tell you more about this event and how you can get involved. And if you want to check for updates on social media, go to our Facebook page which is North Reading Town Day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for organizing the event, Jerry. I appreciate it. Thank you for allowing me to. Jerry's my committee chair. <laughs> thank goodness for Jerry. Appreciate it. Thanks. All, All right. right. Thank you.